Hey, what is up guys? Kita Rock here. Welcome back to another Tower of Dawn guide. We have floor 116. Alright, gonna use a Persona Mercenary. Alright, so this floor basically just focus on the boss by having Lilith pull the boss over. So I think you need Lilith's Soul Gear plus 10 for this to work. So we need to... Yeah, so you need to be able to pull boss all the way to this tile right here Hyuksa will then need to use uh, the third skill oh man I forgot to grace alright so Hyuksa use a uh, third skill just like that alright so this is the hard part we're gonna move Chris right here Chris is gonna use third skill on our heroes so Persona is gonna do something very different. So we're gonna swap Warrior with Persona. We want to move the boss right here. Soup. Alright, so that will open up. Uh, that will make the boss face the other direction and will give us much better chance to actually uh, build Lord Gauge which you sort of need unless I don't know it's kind of hard to build lot gauge for this one to have grace constant up every two turns actually uh, if you don't disturb the other minions I think you should be fine unless you start killing the minions then the wolves you know they will start uh, having very high very very high attack anyway so just do what I do and you should be fine Lilith use second skill decrease defense Alright, and then Hyuksa. Hmm. Alright, the boss didn't get the poison last time around. I think not. So we're gonna try it again. No poison, that's odd. Very odd. So we're gonna use. Uh, That skill from Warrior to help with Lord Gage and then second skill from Yeka. Alright, so Chris needs 100% aggro, and once you have that, you should be fine. Basically, the fairies will only uh, swap with Chris and no one else. Oops, Hukes off the target right now. Alright, so just keep doing what you're doing. Second skill. We're gonna move a uh, Hyuksa right here. Hit the boss from there. Warrior is gonna use first skill. And unfortunately, it's still not enough. So we're gonna have to hang on for one turn. Chris will have to endure it. All this damage. Don't have grace yet. It's unfortunate, but we'll get the grace up next turn, hopefully. Alright, so same deal. Second skill from Lilith. Hukes are a... Uh, ah, uh, wrong target. Wrong target. Guess we'll just end turn with Chris. Move for Young here. Third skill, hit the boss. And... Yeah, I guess we'll move. We will move... Um, Yekaterina right there. One wolf down! Alright. Gotta be careful with those things. Swap can fail as well. So gotta gotta uh, be prepared for that. Alright, so just constant spam second skill for Lilith. Hyuksa just use a uh, awakening skill for now. Hopefully we get the poison off. It's very important to to get Did we get the poison? 
Yeah, finally. The boss is not immune to poison, but because Hyuksa's third skill is not uh, 100%, the poison chance is like 90% or something like that. Uh, yeah, so we didn't get it off the first two turns, which was extremely unlucky on our part. But we got it off right now, which is cool. So that will help fasten the process of getting rid of the boss, which is the only he the only enemies you should be focusing on, and just uh, avoid the others. All right, so we're gonna stay put for now and enjoy the music. I'll come back once the turn, once we manage to lower the boss even more. Alright, so that's how you do it. Wow, finally managed to do it. Uh, managed to finish it within 13 turns, but I guess if you got lucky, luckier than me with the poison thing, uh, which I did not get off in the first two turns, then maybe you can finish it within 10 turns. Alright, so here are the equipments I have on my heroes. Uh, you don't need anything special on Lilith, but it will help if you give him some buff sets. So basically slot 3, slot 4, and slot 5, I'm giving him uh, something that boosts everyone's damage that will help a little bit so make sure to have his soldier uh, plus 10 on this because it ends one pull range which you will need to pull the boss in alright so Hyuksa is there for the poison damage uh, nothing special on his items uh, basically yeah nothing really special right there so Chris 100% aggro other than that uh, it's just a bonus uh, basically slime king or whatever uh, basically make her as tanky as possible, you know, with defense runes and such. In case you don't have Grace up, she can still survive. Alright, so Warion equipments. Uh, this is just my BOH equipment, which I haven't switched out. Runes and Yekaterina. So basically, uh, as much MP regen as you can towards uh, Yekaterina and if you can give Warion some MP regen as well. Alright guys, hope you enjoyed the brief guide. Uh, as Always, if you are new to the channel, feel free to subscribe, give this video a like, and I will see you guys in the next one. Have a nice day. Goodbye.